it could be very inflationary. And the problem is if you don't own a home and you don't own a home right now, you're going to have a two-pronged problem. Number one, you're going to have inflation, which means that just by time going by, the inflation, the house, the cost of the house will go up. The other thing is if the Federal Reserve comes in and, let's say, helps out a politician before an election and reduces rates, even with a high inflation print, you could see those home prices go up, in my opinion, 5, 10, 20 percent. That would be just insane, Neil. You would start to have a buying frenzy again, much like during COVID. So I think right now the good thing is that mortgage rates are high, but if they lower those rates, those, those prices could skyrocket again. Indeed, it, a lot depends on those rates, to your point, Bill. And I caught up with Barbara Corcoran on this very subject and what she says are some of the seminal inflection points she's looking for for real estate in general. Here's what she said on the matter. This is from Barbara Corcoran. If rates go down just another percentage point, that's what I'm hoping for by year, and prices are going to go through the roof. And the so reason for that... That would be around 6%, get yes, to that level. Because everyone will come out and buy. There are probably... 10 buyers on the sidelines waiting for interest rates to come down that are actually active in the market. So everybody's going to charge the market. All right, now she 